in the world of copilot studio whenever you want to add any new item inside your sharepoint list at that time you are simply clicking on add tool option over here and usually we are searching over here for the sharepoint option whenever you click on the sharepoint option it will show you the different connector option in order to select from so let's say i'm selecting create item tool over here now whenever we want to configure this action couple of things you need to consider as a base practice, it's always recommended to provide the proper name and description over here that will help your copilot agent to process smoothly. Second thing is that input parameter. So here you can see couple of input parameters options available over here. Now at least the site address and list name are something which you need to provide by your own over here. And whatever the rest of the parameter you want to supply over here dynamically fill with AI. At the time what you need to do is simply need to go to the add input option over here. And this is basically op uh, available on the right hand side over here. Click on that. Basically it will expose all your list column over here. Pick up the appropriate column. And once you add that that will be available as a part of your input parameter over here and now basically over here as well you can provide that dynamically fill with ai option over here which means that whatever content is supplied over that based on that it will supply that value to your sharepoint list isn't this trip cool